What is a hair transplant? For those suffering from androgenetic alopecia, more commonly known as pattern baldness, patients will keep an area around the back and sides of their head which is not affected by the balding process. This area is known as the donor region. When hair is removed from the donor region and transplanted into an area of thinning or baldness, the hair will keep the characteristics of the area from which it came. This means that the hair will remain unaffected by the balding process in its new home and will stay on the patient's head for the rest of their lives. No special medication or shampoos are needed to maintain the transplanted hair. A patient will be awake throughout their hair transplant and will feel no pain. A local anaesthetic is used, similar to that used by your dentist. Patients will relax, watch movies and listen to music during their procedure. Once removed from the donor region, each hair graft is individually prepared for transplantation. And at the same time, small incisions are made in the recipient areas where the new grafts are to be transplanted. A hair graft is a naturally occurring group of hairs, which can contain between one and four hairs each. On average, there are two hairs in each hair graft. Over 4,000 hair grafts can be transplanted in a single day's procedure. An average hair transplant procedure for a patient with moderate hair loss involves the transplantation of approximately 2,000 hair grafts. As the transplanted hair is permanent, the design of every patient's transplant must be well thought out to ensure that it looks natural for the rest of the patient's life. A properly executed hair transplant should involve very careful planning with a large team of hair transplant technicians and nurses and should only be carried out by a qualified consultant surgeon. The procedure is carried out during the course of a single day, taking anywhere between 6 and 10 hours. Most patients return to work within a few days without anyone...